as long as I can remember, I have looked for an equal. One who could push me. One who could surprise me. One who could even beat me. Yet all I found is disappointment. Will one of you finally give me what I desire? What have you done with MJ? Well, oh, Parker, no clever quip about the suit? Oh, I'm disappointed. Where is she? Kill him already. I've got stuff to do. Here. I realized that you didn't kill my father. The darkness that consumed him almost finished me too. But you never turned away from me. Even after everything I did, I had to. I realized that. Is this who you're looking for? Get away from her. If you insist. He isn't going anywhere. Now's your chance to rescue MJ. Harry? He's kidnapped a little girl. She's in the trunk. Got her. Harry, get them away from here. Penny! He took your little girl. And he killed her. Your little girl? Give me my daughter! Time to put the Sandman to sleep. Harry! Fair's fair, Parker. Now it's time for a little one-on-one. -on -one. The game ends here. Ah! I couldn't control it. Ah! He's gone. I'm trying to tell myself that I'm just jealous of Walker Sloan's progress. It was only five years ago that he first showed up at Alchemax talking about harnessing energy from the fourth dimension. Now he won't stop until he's running the place. I know his type. He's thinking beyond Alchemax, aiming towards who knows what. He's the exact type of corporate monster I've sworn to rein in. Especially if he's mucking with time travel. The year 2099 might not be much, but it's all mine. And he's not going to change it. He's been siphoning Alchemax resources into converting the gateway in the old virtual unreality lab into something else. Something dangerous. I've tried talking to him, but he's got no time for Miguel O'Hara. But people make time for Spider-Man. Just use the convenient access to the ventilation system to get inside, and then Walker and I can have a little chat.